What is up guys, this is L Saver checking in. Welcome back to my channel and also welcome back to a brand new pickups review. So today we're gonna be talking about my latest pickup, which is this Balenciaga Trooper boot in this rubber finish. It just arrived in the mail, so I'm pretty excited to go over this with you guys. So without further ado, I know why you guys clicked on this video because you guys probably wanted to see the way the shoe looks and probably wanted to know how this shoe fits and feels, right? And let's talk about the box label. It is kind of important later on down the line when they start replicating these shoes it's kind of good to have a little bit of comparison so first things i notice is you're going to get the image of the shoe and you're going to have this word for internal use only printed on the top of the shoe in the white finish and you're going to have the skews on the side with barcode and also the sizing let's jump straight into the shoe box square shaped balenciaga box and we're gonna get this in a gray brush finish, Balenciaga font on the top and a gloss black finish, okay? Inside, we're gonna get the standard stuffing paper that's in gray, and we're gonna get two dust bags inside the shoes. As soon as when we take out these shoes out of the dust bag, you're gonna get a strong glue smell. Yeah, it's made in Italy. On the inside of the shoe is stamped Balenciaga Trooper with the size and a shortened version of the skew. On the midsection of the insole, we're gonna get this traditional Balenciaga font that's stamped in the middle. Like you're gonna see that on a lot of Balenciaga products, especially the sneakers. Pretty much it. On the outside of the shoe, you're gonna get this massive, heavy duty boot, right? It's high quality. Let me tell you guys, if you guys are spending the money on this shoe, you guys will feel very excited once you guys get these things on hand because it is really good quality and the finish is amazing. It's very, very soft, but it could get scratched very, very easily because this matted black rubber is not protected. Fitting of these shoes, they're gonna fit a little bit funky. It's not gonna fit like your standard tennis shoe okay it's not meant to fit as tight so you guys don't need to be downsizing two times or two sizes that's probably why everyone's saying oh my gosh these shoes are very uncomfortable but it's not you guys only need to go down one size if you have a standard size foot it's gonna feel decent okay it's not the most comfortable shoes because the materials are very very stiff and very firm especially on italian products you guys know how this stuff is it's not like nikes it's not like adidas it's not like new balance so it's going to fit very different but at the same time if you guys know you guys are on the wider foot side and you guys know you guys are always upsizing on shoes stay true to size that's my only recommendation for you guys and keep in mind this shoe on the back of the heel it has so much added to it that it makes you very very tall i definitely feel like i'm over six foot with these type of boots on if you're not into the dark techno underground raver kind of shoe there's other options like the derbies okay the derbies are like the doc martens you're gonna get the standard low top loafer with the big giant square toe and if you guys want something exotic you're gonna have the rhino toes and if you want just something more plain with like a trench coat or something like this but you still want to be very balenciaga they have the standard troopers which is just a high top leather model which is also really cool that's pretty much all i have to say on this type of pickup i'm pretty excited to be rocking this over the winter time you know i was in the market for a rain boot i was looking at the bottegas every new season these designer brands are always jacking up the prices okay the new price bracket for that one is over 700 so i was like you know what i kind of want to browse around to see if they have other options and i stumbled across this balenciaga trooper boot and i was like whoa this kind of looks a little bit more like my style so i was like i'm gonna run this that's pretty much all i have to say on this pickup i appreciate you guys for watching this video and last but not least hit that subscribe button because i know only one percent of you guys are subscribed and i hit over 600 000 views and 99 percent of you guys are not subscribed so just please if you get to help out this channel hit that subscribe button for me and i'll continue to you know post videos whenever i can like i said i appreciate y'all for uh, checking out this video and last but not least drop your comments down below and i'll catch you guys on the next one peace